Okay, so isn't it annoying when you go into a website and you get one of these video ads come up? It's just so frustrating. Some of them are quite loud because they start with audio as well. Some of them are just plain annoying. This guide is going to show you how you can stop these video ads from appearing in Microsoft Edge. Hang around, more details coming up. Don't forget to like this video, share it and subscribe to my channel. Doing these three things will help us make more great videos for you. So as I say, this video is going to show you how you can stop these animations and animated ads from coming up. We're going to go through a couple of ways of doing this. Now, as you can see here, I've opened up Edge and straight away I've got this animation on the screen. Now, why wouldn't I want that? It looks lovely, looks pretty. Well, it takes up more processing power, more RAM. It, it involves more internet download bandwidth as well. So if you're on a limited connection, then it's taking more data it's just generally going to slow the computer up as well, just a little bit, especially if you haven't got a very powerful computer to start with. So first of all, let's just try and stop this from going on. So the first thing to try is you need to hold down the Windows key on your keyboard. The Windows key is denoted by the Windows flag and is usually between the CTRL and the ALT key or the FN key and the ALT key on the bottom row of keys on your keyboard on the left hand side. So hold down the Windows flag, then tap the letter R, R for Romeo. The run box should appear, let go of the Windows key and if there's anything in open, just delete it out OK, and then type control, then press enter or return on your keyboard. Once you've done that, control panel should open. And if you've got a screen like this, then just go up to view by, click on the word category and then click large items. If you've already got large items and that's fine, you don't need to do that. If you've got small items, then you can still use this, but it just makes it a bit easier to see if you select large icons. We need to go into system there. So you might have to scroll down to go into system. So just double click system. And then if you're running Windows 10 or 11, you'll probably see a screen similar to this. So just click on advanced system settings. OK, once you see that, then click on settings under performance. If you see something different here, then click on the advanced tab just at the top of the screen. But ideally you're looking for settings under performance. So click on that. And then what you want to do is you want to make sure there's no tick in animate controls and elements inside Windows. So remove that tick, click on apply and then click on OK. Click on OK on this box here and then click on the cross just up here. Now, this won't help in every uh, situation, but it might help in most. So I'm just going to click on the cross there just to get rid of this box. I'm going to go into Microsoft Edge. Sometimes you do need to log out and log back in again for this to work. So in actual fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to log out. So I'm going to click the start button, click on user and then click on sign out, okay? And let it sign out and then I'm gonna sign back in again. So let's just do that. There we go, I'm gonna sign in. And once it's signed in, I'm gonna to go to Edge and we're gonna see if that's made any difference. Like I say, sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't with this. So let's just open it up and there you go. As you can see, it says to autoplay video, set animation in Windows 2 on and it's not moving now, that, that little uh, animation there. But if I go to some other websites, like the Sky website, that won't have solved the problem with the video playing. So how do you do things like that as well? So we're going to step up a gear now. And what we're going to do is we're going to click into the address bar at the top of the screen right here. OK, and we're going to type edge colon forward slash forward slash flags just as it's shown on the screen right there then press enter or return on your keyboard and then what we're going to do is in search flags we are going to type show space block so that's show space block 
and then you should see underneath after a few seconds show block option in autoplay settings and it says if enabled block will appear as an option in media autoplay settings mac windows linux android so okay let's just click on the little arrow pointing down just to the right of default and click on enabled it says here at the bottom of the screen your changes will take effect after you restart microsoft edge so i'm going to restart it just by clicking on the blue and white restart down there it will shut down start up again and then what we can do is if we go into settings just over here and then down to this settings just down here click on that and then what we're going to look for is site permissions now so there it is it's under cookies and site permissions and then we scroll down the page to the all permissions section just keep going down and you should see down there media autoplay so once you see that click on the little arrow just to the right and it says here control if audio and video play automatically on sites so at the moment mine is selected to uh, sort of set to limit so i'm going to click on the downward arrow there and just say block and this should block all sites from auto playing any videos so let's just close edge down and then go back into it again so let's go back to youtube and have a look there and there we go as you can see there are no animated ads now coming up in there now it doesn't work okay on all sites if i go back to sky for instance let's just go back into that then the animations still do appear unfortunately there doesn't seem to be a way around that but like i say certainly other sites like um, the msn website and youtube you're no longer getting any video ads. You're still getting adverts, but you're not getting any video ads or video animations come up. So there we go. I hope you like this video. If you've got any other suggestions, don't forget, comment in the comments down below. And whilst you're here, don't forget to have a look around my YouTube channel. I've got thousands of other videos covering all sorts of subjects. Hopefully, you're going to find something to educate you, entertain you, amuse you, and maybe even save you some money. I hope you liked this video, and if you did, hit that like button. If you think your friends, your family, or your work colleagues might like it, then don't forget to share this on your social media timelines. And if you haven't done so already, make sure you find out about all my latest videos the second they're released hit that subscribe button, then hit the bell, then hit all. You can also find me on Twitter at CWTech and also find my website at cwtech.co.uk. Liking, sharing and subscribing really helps support this channel. Thank you very much.